what's up guys watching Tony's fitness so of another YouTube video but before I get into the video as usual please like and subscribe because it would help me out a lot and you guys know I'm trying to grow the YouTube channel and so yeah if you like fitness content legit content that's not gonna tell you to use a freaking ab stimulator to get abs like like Noah Beck or something then subscribe to me if you want proper information and yeah anyway getting on with the video this video is going to be about, is Diet Coke making you hungry? Is, is Diet Coke triggering ghrelin? So, I'm going to start off by saying it actually is, alright? What it is, sweeteners mimic, alright, sugar, okay? Now, the, the zero calories in sweetener, so it can, can't get you fat, okay? It can't. Zero calories, thermal dynamically, I think that's how you say it. The, the laws of thermal dynamics say... Zero calories can't get you fat, okay? Zero calories will not get you fat. It's not good for you. I'm not saying go eat a whole massive thing of stevia or something. But it, it's not going to get you fat. Like, that's the bottom line. But one thing it does do that, that sugar does. If you eat something like a, a sugar cookie, right? One, there's going to be no fibre in it. It's not going to fill you up. Two, it's going to be covered in sugar. Now, what sugar does is it makes you crave stuff, like, a lot. It's like an addiction. It's like get, having a cigarette if you're addicted to smoking and having a cigarette after about 10 years of quitting, you're going to try it again and then you're going to get addicted, all right? Well, not, not as bad as that. But basically, sugar makes you crave junk food more and it makes you hungrier. And sweetener just mimics it, does the exact same thing basically, except it's a lot better for you because it, it can't get you fat. So if you're drinking Diet Coke all day or like a sugar free whatever drinks, like I, so what I've done because I've noticed it does make me feel a little bit hungrier, what I've done is I've toned down to maybe, I don't know, a couple cans a day. Maybe, maybe three cans, which is pretty good considering I used to eat, I don't know, maybe... Fr well, I didn't used to eat it. I used to drink it. Sorry, guys. I, I used to have about three litres of Diet Coke or just sugar-free pop. And honestly, I feel less hungry now that I um, have cut back on my Diet Coke. So, yeah, maybe um, just lay off the Diet Coke for a bit. Do you have it, though? have it all the time trust me i i still have it quite a lot like for real but just remember it's going to trigger trigger ghrelin so i would recommend you have it in the day and not before bed because you know the worst thing ever i'm sure that with all the experiences is when you literally can't get to sleep you're that hungry and yeah i'm gonna end the video there guys please like and subscribe remember progressive overload is your life peace out